So what's going on, Dirty Laundry family? It's your man on line, Bill Money, checking back in with you on this Friday night. I uh, hope everything is well with you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Uh, so real quickly, want to hit you with a story from uh, here in Atlanta. Uh, saw this story earlier and um, looked a little bit into it. There was a high-speed chase that ended uh, with a crash uh, with police on uh, Georgia 400 up around the 285 area and they said it was a local rapper so I said let me look into uh, who this local rapper is and the young brother named Paper Love um, who was actually involved in the incident and it just struck me because I'm uh, familiar with the young brother I don't know the guy uh, but a friend of mine who has an independent record label um, knows him well and they've collaborated on um, projects in the past um, so yeah, it definitely struck me, and um, I said, let me just uh, drop a quick little story um, about this young brother. Um, again, he goes by the name Paper Love. Uh, he was born in Chicago, raised in Atlanta, uh, born Ibn Issa Durr on August 20th, 1996. Um, young brother been rapping since around the age of 12, um, and he used to release uh, music under the name Cash Set Paper um, for a time before debuting as Paper Love. Uh, with his 2016 single Why Wait um, Young Brother says he looks up to uh, Chris Brown and Lil Wayne musically and he actually signed a deal with 300 ENT back in 2018 um, so his style is a blend between you know rap and uh, the new age uh, with the melodic vocals um, he's followed with several singles since that time and um, in 2018 he dropped a pretty big record here for you uh, R&B flavored um, he also put a music video with that. Um, so, yeah, it was definitely um, surprising, but not surprising because a lot of times these brothers uh, come from the street, have one foot in the game and one foot in the industry, and they just bring a lot of baggage into the game with them. And sometimes it's just hard to set that baggage to the side and, and focusing on, on, on charting your path out of the streets. So, you know, again, hate to see the young brother uh, caught up um, but shit, shit happens. Um, hop down in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Um, this your man, Bill Money. Smash that like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the other side. A local musician in jail after getting into a chase, then crashing into Sandy Springs police officers. This is Ibnissa Durr, known professionally as Paper Lovey. This all happening near Georgia 400 and Interstate 285. Chopper 46 was overhead. Following that crash, you could see Durr's BMW on the road. We will show you that in just a minute. This is that Chopper 46 video. You see that wreckage right there. CBS 46's Adam Murphy joins me live near the scene. And, and Adam, a lot of chaos certainly on the road today. Hey, good evening there, Tracy. This wild scene took place right back there, just like you mentioned, all 400 at 285. Incredibly, no one was seriously hurt, considering there are thousands of people that drive through this area daily. Up and coming local rapper, Paper Lovey, also known as Ibnisa Dur, celebrated his 25th birthday in police custody following a wild chase at Georgia 400 and 285. We are going to track you down, and we are going to hold you accountable for what you did. Sergeant John Chafee said APD secured warrants on Durr for allegedly shooting another person multiple times at an Atlanta convenience store on Allison Court back in May. Our fugitive unit had been able to locate him, um, so they were actually tracking him um, following him at the time that this occurred. We requested marked patrol cars to come in and assist with apprehending him. Durr attempted to elude police and slammed into two Sandy Springs police cars. He then got out of the car and tried to run. He got out of the car with a firearm in his hand and uh, there was a fight that ensued. Luckily, our officers were able to disarm him without further incident and they took him into custody. One Sandy Springs police officer did suffer a head injury when Paper Lovey slammed into his patrol car. The officer was taken to the hospital and is receiving treatment for a non-life-threatening injury. This could have been an easy uh, case of deadly force, but we have to consider all the people, all the innocent people in the background.
and Sandy Springs police tell me they go through several hours of training every year for situations just like this, and they put that training into action today out here at 400 and 285. They were able to get their man and at the same time keep the public safe. We're live in Sandy Springs, Adam Murphy, CBS 46. And you got one like uh, towards the top of your forehead there. Say it's complicated. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people that I work with say I'm difficult. A lot of people that I got love for say I'm difficult. You know what I'm saying? I'm hard, kind of hard to work with sometimes, so I got difficult to right there. Complicated.